Hello everybody, this is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo. You know, several years ago, I had a gentleman come up to me and ask me if I wanted a bag of broken jewelry. Well, I kind of looked at him like he was crazy, but he says, no, come here, I want to show you what I have. So he showed me this big, giant bag. I mean, it was huge, full of broken jewelry. And when I first started going through it, I thought, I don't know what I could do with this, but there were lots of loose beads and just interesting things. And so I thought, you know, I'll, I'll take it. I'll see what I can do with it. And I got home, I sorted it out, and uh, a lot of the pieces just needed to be fixed, like maybe a jump ring was missing or something like that. So I fixed it, and then I donated it to the Senior Center for, um, they have bingo, and they needed different prizes and stuff for their their winners so I was able to donate some of the pieces there but I kind of got tired of it bagged it up put it away and today as I was going through some stuff I came across it so I was going back through it and I thought you know what I'm going to challenge myself to take some of this old broken jewelry junk and try to make something really nice out of it the first piece that I have is this bracelet now um, these, these pieces actually came from a, a local manufacturer and they've never been worn. It's just they, something happened during the manufacturing. This particular one, as you can see, this is coming off. Uh, the rhinestones are missing. I mean, it was probably, it would have been a really pretty bracelet. It's got, uh, turquoise and gold rhinestones and all. And then on this side of rough but uh, I'm gonna see what I can do with it and I wanted to show you the before here's the before and then I'll come back when I get the after done hello I'm back I finished my bracelet I just wanted to show you what I came up with this is it the finished product so I'm gonna tell you kind of my thought process when I first decided to repurpose this bracelet, I really liked the rhinestones and I wanted them to be seen. And I thought, well, maybe I should just add more crystals to it. Kind of like I've done my guitar string bracelets where I just put lots and lots of crystals and different beads. But as I was looking through some of the beads that I have, I remembered I had this really pretty sari ribbon. And um, it has um, little flecks of brass in it and this bracelet being on the brass side and I was using brass wire I thought would be perfect. It also has little rhinestones throughout the uh, sari ribbon also. Uh, I will put a picture uh, of the uh, materials that I used to make this but I just kind of wanted to show you what I came up with. There's a little peekaboo of the original rhinestones that were on there. And I did not add any more beads, just recycled sari ribbon and brass wire. And that's it. And I just kept this as it was. I liked the texture on it. So I actually will be doing more of these videos on how I uh, take old or maybe a uh, an earring that I have, one earring of, and repurposing it into another piece of jewelry. So stay tuned. I do have other um, videos that I've done this with. Uh, but anyway, I hope you uh, subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up. And most of all, y'all have a wonderful day. This is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo signing out for now. Bye-bye.